Hello viewers, this is Rajiv Bhumi and you are watching my channel Make Things Easy. In this video, I am going to tell you about 8D. So watch this video till the end. In any regular manufacturing or service industry, whenever any process non-conformity or customer complaint occurs, normal practice we follow is what is the problem statement, then what is the root cause analysis, that is RCA, and what are the corrective actions. But after doing all these things, the same will not reoccur. There is no assurance. That is a big question on permanent solution. So for permanent assured solution, 8D is needed. Now let us understand what is 8D. 8D means 8 disciplines. Now let us see what are those 8 disciplines. 1D, team formation. 2D, problem description. 3D, interim containment action. 4D, root cause analysis that is RCA. 5D, corrective action. 6D, Validate corrective action 7D. Identify and implement preventive action 8D. Team and individual recognition. Now I will explain you all the disciplines one by one. 1D team formation. Who should be in the 8D team and their responsibilities? First is champion. Champion is an executive sponsor, not a working team member. He or she is the ultimate responsible for fixing the problem. Then team leader, the person who coordinates the entire 8D project. Then team members. Team members must complete their responsibilities and action and report back to team leader for their progress. d problem description this is the stage where you need to most accurately describe the problem properly problem description is the starting point to further step of analysis and proper understanding of the nature of the problem for the team as well as people from outside 3D, interim containment action. An interim containment action is put in place to prevent the effect of problem from impacting customer while a permanent solution is being developed and implemented. Few examples are informing operators, stoppage of production or shipment, Additional visual control, informing customer, segregation. Four D, root cause analysis. That is RCA. Root cause analysis is a term that describes the techniques and tools used to uncover causes of problems. So let us see what are the tools used for root cause analysis. Pareto chart, brainstorming, 5Y analysis, Fishbone diagram, fault tree analysis, statistical analysis, regression analysis, hypothesis testing, flowchart, FMEA. Five D, permanent corrective action. The team determine which actions and solutions should be introduced to ensure that the process and product is controlled and will make the problem go away without leading into other unwanted issues. Criteria for choosing the best solutions are practical, 
feasible, robust, and cost effective. Six D, validate corrective action. You need to verify that the corrective actions taken are efficiently. It should be based on real data from the process. Few examples are less rejection percentage or PPM, improved test results, correct measurements, better quality from suppliers. Seven D. Identify and implement preventive action. This step is to determine what action should be taken to prevent recurrence of the problem. Preventing recurrence is an important part of a problem solution. To prevent recurrence of the problem, the team must verify that the outcome of their action plan works and on target. Various tools to be used are control charts, FMEA, gauge RNR, process capability analysis, histograms. 8D, team and individual recognition. Once a team has completed implementing the solution and ensured that the solution works, all team members deserve to be congratulated. Team members need to know that their efforts are appreciated and that the organization knows about their accomplishments. The 8D reports gives a quick snapshot of what was done. The report serves as a communication tool. It is a very useful tool to share is the lesson learned, completed 8D report to be shared with all. 8D. Now let us see how a 8D report looks like. Now let us see what are the benefits of 8D. Assured quality, no repetitive failure. Assurance towards customer satisfaction. No rejection at final stage. Timely completion of right job. Cost saving. Timely delivery. Increased productivity. Improves moral togetherness, teamwork. So viewers, I hope you have liked this video. If you have not subscribed my channel, please subscribe it. Like this video, share this video. And if you want to comment something, please leave your comment in the comment section. Thank you once again for watching this video.